One of the most popular destinations here at the Outdoor Recreation Zone at Electrify Expo is this, the living vehicle. As you can see, it's a camper, but it's a little more than that. It is Electrify, so of course there needs to be a little electric twist. Let's go see what it is. A living vehicle is a fully off-grid capable travel trailer. You're basically living in like a luxury New York City apartment here. And you have a washer and dryer, dishwasher, luxury shower. This unit here specifically has 2,600 watts of solar. We do have units that go up to about 5,500 watts, oh, not wow. about watts of solar. Battery storage here is 30 kilowatt hours. And we have units that go up to 72 kilowatt hours of battery storage. So if you're a layman, that's a lot. And we've got full-sized uh, appliances in here. I mean, this is a massive fridge. Yeah, you have a, a stove um, capable of getting up to 500 degrees, uh, a microwave, dishwasher down here. This island here is removable, so you can put this out on your deck, really open up this space. You got this couch, TV. Couch here, yeah. So this turns into a queen-size bed. We also have the option of getting a queen Euro loft, so a queen bed that would come out of the ceiling, so you'd have you know, bunks. And you have a smart TV right here. So this is kind of like your lounge area where you hang out. This unit also was configured with a home theater in the bedroom. So it has a projector with a 76 inch drop down screen TV. Well, gotta so. take a look at that. Bathrooms, honestly, one of my favorite features. I mean, I'm 6'3". I have, you know, plenty of room above my head here, still in the shower. I don't know if it comes across on camera, but this is by far the largest, most luxurious RV bathroom I've ever been in. I mean, There's a skylight. Oh, yeah, you have a skylight in the shower, skylight above the bed as well, so. Yeah, speaking of, let's go look at the bed. Ooh! So I love the washer and dryer. Yeah. I, being able to stay in this thing and like do your laundry is just absolutely amazing. Yeah. The bed is a queen size bed and it lifts up and it does have storage underneath there. Um, and then here's your projector screen here. Oh, that's so massive. that drops down and then your projector's over there. If you're running the AC, if you're taking showers, watching TV, how long can you be off grid in one of these things? We always tell people kind of like get off grid for a little bit, you know, when they first take delivery of their unit and kind of play around with you know, what you need to run, what you don't need to run. Um, I have personally had one customer live up to three weeks off grid. He was wow. a single guy, so by himself, he was very conservative with his water, but these are solar charged. So your, your solar is constantly charging your battery. Uh, as long as you have sun and you're getting solar, you could be running both your ACs. So y'all just got out of the living vehicle. How was it? A uh, living vehicle is really nice. It kind of reminds me of like a new age approach to the old Airstreams. It's huge, a lot of space, a lot of space, a lot of amenities. The bathroom is bigger than my bathroom. It's huge. You can fit two queen beds in there, that's unreal. Two queen beds, that's crazy. That's like at least four people. Are you a big camper? No. No? <laughs> Not in the least. But you just like had, the technology? We've had um, RVs before, I've had trailers before, and I'm retired now, and I wanna like go see places and do things. That's the way to do it. How does this compare to RVs you've had in the past? I've never had an RV that had an outdoor. The patio deck is like our signature feature. It kind of brings the outdoor space um, inside. And just being able to have that space while you're inside cooking and eating and just living, kind of feel like you're there still out in nature is just absolutely amazing. I mean, you said this is like a New York luxury apartment. I mean, it's better. Oh, I know yeah. a lot of New York apartments without <laughs> this. So. We just released a week ago something called the Cyber Trailer. So it is a trailer built kind of specifically geared towards the cyber truck, but any um, EV truck will be able to tow it. For that, that'll go into production in 2025. Livingvehicle.com, go check them out. Thank you very much. Thanks, man, appreciate it.